Oasis Hospital was started in 1960 at the invitation of Sheikh Zayed uh, Al Nahyan and his brother Sheikh Shakabut. Members of the Al Nahyan family had traveled to uh, hospitals for medical care in both Manama as well as in Muscat, uh, Oman. And they'd been impressed with the, the services, the manner and the quality of care that was uh, provided by Christian physicians there. So um, Sheikh Zayed asked that the hospital in Muscat provide a full-time physician for his hometown here in Alain. Around that time, Drs. Pat and Marion Kennedy had finished medical school and their medical training in 1955, and they felt strongly that the Lord would have them use their experience, their skills, their efforts to serve people in this region. They thought it would be a beautiful opportunity to reflect the love that Christ had given them. One of the most special things about the hospital is the connection it has with the community. We've been here for about 60 years, and when the first doctors, doctors Pat and Mary and Kenny came, there was really nothing else out here as far as uh, good medical care. We're thankful uh, that Sheikh uh, Zayed at the time uh, invited the Kennedys to come here. It's always been a partnership with the ruling family and Oasis Hospital from the start. But the connection really to the community has stayed throughout the years. We have uh, biblical verses around the hospital openly displayed and we have Bibles in the building that are freely accessible and uh, can be taken by anybody who likes them. It is very known to everybody in Alain, to the royal family and, and the government, that who we are, what we do, uh, what we stand for, what we practice, and how we uh, care for people. When we talk about the DNA of Oasis Hospital, all the staff think of the words, the love and compassion of Christ. When someone comes here, we don't want them to just think that they had great medical care. We want them to say, there's that thing that was different, and I don't know exactly what it is, but the people treated me like they really cared for me. And uh, that's one of the, the things that really is, is unique about being here, is people striving to want to do that. Our mission is very clear that we share the compassion and love of Jesus Christ, the way we care for patients, and uh, we do so unexcusably. So to share the love and compassion of Jesus Christ in, in that way uh, is uh, very dear to us. It's something we're growing every day. It's something that we invest into every day. And uh, it's something which we hope to be doing for many generations to come. I think about the, the lives of the Kennedys, the littles, the nurses, the staff that worked here for so many years and just persisted uh, to display the love of Christ. I'm often reminded of, of Matthew 5, 16, where Jesus reminds us in the same way, let your light so shine before men that they might see your good works and glorify your Father who is in heaven.